All right, so we're going to start with number two, which is x plus two over 2x squared minus 4. All right. Now, because the degree of the denominator is one is more than the degree of the numerator, our horizontal asymptote is at y equals 0. All right. Now, if I look to factor my denominator, I pull out the 2, I got x squared minus 2, all right, which really doesn't factor in anything. So basically, all right, plus minus root 2 are the vertical asymptotes. All right, so when I graph it, all right, I'm going to have my horizontal asymptote at y equals zero. And my vert I'm going to estimate plus minus root two. So that's about 1.4. So I'm going to have my vertical asymptotes at negative 1.4 and positive 1.4. All right, one point I can use is negative one, because that's on the left-hand side of that region, negative one plus two would be 1, negative 1 squared is 1, 2 minus 4 is negative 2, so that puts me at negative 1 half, which is about there. If I plug in 1, 1 plus 2 is 3, 2 minus 4 is once again negative 2, so that's also underneath. So that tells me my graph is going to be underneath. That sound. All right. Okay, so that gives me the region inside. When I go to the right, so that would be at about two. If I plug that in, I'm gonna have four on the numerator and four in the denominator. So that puts me at one. So that tells me that part of the graph looks like that. All right, and then I'll do the same thing over here with negative two. Negative two plus two is zero. Zero divided by anything is zero. Ooh. Zero. That's weird. So if I plug negative three in, negative three plus two is negative one. 18 minus four, so I'm a little underneath. So that means my graph's going to look something like that. All right, so that takes care of number two.